I had this bad chick up town, she was Whoa. Had me messed up in the head, I mean Whoa. Bought the chick diamonds and pearls, I mean Whoa. Hey guys, it's me again I know it's been a long time I've been through several ordeals I'm not even gonna get into it This video, that's not what it's about No, I was like really hype about it But I was in an ordeal And I'm trying to get my freaking life together And I'm just like, oh my god Like, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this So I went um to my nearest Sephora And I went to go get the foundation They were sold the freak out okay but just wait for it wait for it i'm not like misleading you i got the world's smallest sample guys <laughs> they had the sample bottle there and i'm like can i please get a sample and i love sephora for that they gave me a sample and this is the filter foundation in number 310 simply i just wanted to do this this is why i got the world's smallest sample so that you guys can see what this foundation actually looks like i know i've been scanning through the media and i've seen that some people like it some people don't um i want to decide for myself so as usual for my oily skin i use bottom brown and this is face base guys i know i've shown you guys this i usually call it spa in the jar it just smells heavenly it does amazing things it just like literally just seals your pores and my lovely lovely artist number eight brown brush i'm just gonna take that and just dab it since there's no pump and i can't pump it onto my brush so as you guys know i am mixed This is amazing. I wish I had the ring light, you know? Like, I'm thinking, this is nuts. I hope you guys are getting it the way I'm seeing it. I haven't even done, I, haven't, I can't even talk. I haven't even completed one side yet, and I'm literally loving the result of this, guys. Holy. The coverage is just simply impeccable. <laughs> can you see that? Let me try to let me try to show you guys. Oh, there we are. I have to show you guys this. Like, look at this. Look at before and look at after. I haven't even completed blended it, blending it yet, and I look like a brand new human being. Like, do you see that? I'm not even. Oh, I shouldn't even put it on this side so that you guys can see. But clearly, you can see. This is ridiculous. Okay, you see the dark circle on the eye. Usually I have to put concealer. This is nuts! Ah! Go Rihanna. I don't know if actually she was doing like the lab work or she just attached her name to this, like with Fenty Beauty and through like Adidas, like what she does. I'm not sure guys, like I don't know the girl for real. Like in my mind, when I close my eyes, I'm just like Rihanna's my best friend, but I really don't know her guys. And I don't know like, you know, but if she was the one in the lab doing this, making sure seeing everything, like seeing everything through, holy smokes, like kudos to Rihanna. Kudos to Rihanna and her team. I feel like I don't even need concealer. Guys, I'm like totally impressed, okay? And like I just said, since she's my best friend, when I close my eyes, like I'm really proud of my best friend. Like she really did a good job. I feel like, literally I feel like this is all I can wear. Like I could do this like as a day look, like just a coat of mascara, maybe look, yeah. Guys, I told you guys this is gonna be only for, about the foundation. I wish what I'm seeing in person is coming through on the camera. Like I'm trying, I'm opening the windows, I'm opening the curtains. I want you guys to see this, like, and it's, wow. This is blowing my mind. Like, guys, I really did not get paid for this. Like, I told you I went to Sephora. I was lucky enough to have my shade available because everything sold out. And of course, have you seen my subscriber number? Um, I do not have PR contacting me and saying, hey, listen, come through to the release party and we're gonna give you a bag, okay? I went in line with my bruised up, beat up body from the accident and I stood in line and they told me it's sold out. But anyway, I just happened to look and I saw the bottle standing there and I was like, oh my God, I think that's my shade. Like I tested it and I was like, I think that's my shade. Can I have a sample? Cause I have to see what this is all about. Like, is it, you know, is it worth it? Is it not? Guys, look at this, like this is simply just gorgeous. For those of you guys that have been watching me for a long time, you guys have seen pictures of me on Insta. Like I have like really bad acne scars and you know, I take care of my skin or I try to. And this right here just makes my skin look super flawless. Like I'm seriously guys, like I'm serious. I don't even want to contour. I feel amazing. If that was, you know, the whole essence behind this foundation, I feel like this just makes me clean. Um, it's simple. Look, guys, I'm I'm like legit. Look at this. I'm gonna put use the hourglass liquid liner that I have. Oh, 
for those of you guys wondering, this is Lancome, and this is Miss, Monsieur, Monsieur Big, okay? Mr. Big. Oh, like Mr. Big from Sex and the City. Oh, I got it. I don't know if that's where they were going, but anyway. <laughs> Let me stay on track. For my next step, I'm going to be using Sun and Bronze, and this is by NYC Color. And I'm just using my Real Technique brush, and this is the Duo Fiber Contour Brush. So I'm just going to lightly, I just need a little bit of color. And so I'm just going to lightly just a, apply color here. Oh, wow. I feel so fresh, so clean. It's The formula is super light. It's not cakey. It oxidizes well, like... I'm just blown away. I'm like super impressed right now by what I'm seeing. I don't even want to mess it up. Like I really feel like if I add more crap onto my face, like all it's going to do is just mess it up. So all I'm going to do is just keep it light, simple, airy. I don't know if that was their, if that's simply their intention, but for me it's working out. So I'm going to be using MAC Soft and Gentle. I'm just going to add a little bit of glow. Oh, by the way guys, the sticks, um, <clears throat> The highlight sticks are in the collection. Oh, you know, everything was sold out at my store, basically. So the highlight sticks, I applied that. Like, I rolled it on the back of my hand, and I was like, mm, wow! That's so crazy. That was my entire reaction with, like, everything. Now, with Trophy Life, guys, the uh, the, powder, the compact um, highlight powder, like, I liked it, but the only thing I noticed is when you're outside and just regular lighting, it just looks chalky. It looks cakey. But when you come under iridescent light, it's just, it's simply breathtaking. And I'm just like, okay, so maybe if I do end up getting it out of the collection, I think I'm just going to rock that at night <laughs> and blow people's mind away. Just, you know, just glow. All right, guys, so for lip, I'm just going to stay on the clean and simple and fresh look. So for my lip today, I'm going to be using NYX Liquid Suede, and this is Sandstone. I know I always say love you guys and bye, but I want to say love you guys. Life is too short. Enjoy each and every second of the day. Um, the ordeal that I was in totally changed my, changed my perspective on life. Um, and I just want to say I want to live and become a better person. Um, love you guys. Till next time. Bye.